morning world how are you doing special little video today because here in the uk i know it's not celebrated globally around the world i suppose but it is to a certain extent on different times today is mother's day here in the uk um i know it's the second sunday in america that's, that's mothering sunday um mother's day traditionally there's kind of two ways of looking at it it's the fourth sunday and the third before lent if you're into the christian world um but mothering sunday was deemed to celebrate mothers and yes so they should be but times are hard on everybody um and we all like to spoil our mothers and treat our mothers and all this that and the other but i have a mother here this one yeah your mother your mother to this one you're the calm one and you're the crazy one why didn't you make a calm one she nuts yeah i know so it's mother and sunday so this one's going to get a treat there's no point giving it to her to give to her because this one will eat it but anyway, back to where it is, and it got me thinking, I'd be morning coffee, be morning sit down, and having a chat with you guys. With this climate crisis that we're all suffering, and a climate, climate crisis, we'll suffer it, cost of living crisis, I do deject. Um, well, yes, we want to treat our mothers. Um, and the modern world, north of my gate is a world that i don't like to frequent uh, which people in normalsville as i call it often will go out and they will spend a small fortune potentially on their mothers i'm not saying mothers aren't worth every penny but the tradition is for the children would go down down the country lanes and way back i mean you can't in the modern world with cities and things but they would pick wild flowers and take a bunch of wild flowers to their mothers to show them appreciation for what they do and mothers are quite often deemed as maybe oh no it's kind of taken for granted mothers are just mothers aren't they they're just there they do they do what mothers do and but we do do we reflect on exactly what mothers do um especially in this modern world um i was fortunate enough that i was brought up in a world that my mother did work um she was a, a catering manageress in school mills in the days when they were at home in the school holidays for us children and obviously when we were at school my mother was cooking my lunch as all mothers do don't they they all cook your lunch and they cook your breakfast and they cook your dinner and they do the washing up, they do the clearing up, they do the washing, the drying, the ironing, they keep the house clean, they tend your wounds, they look after you when you're not well. They do an awful lot really, don't they? And on top of that, quite often, they hold down a full-time job as well. So mothers have a tendency to work almost 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Well, that's what mothers do, isn't it? Yes, the vast majority of mothers do. I accept there are so-called bad mothers or indifferent. We can all reflect on our mothers being good, bad indifferent 
But I reflect on Mother's Day in such a way that there will have been points in my life where I have not agreed with my mother. Or I've gone against my mother's wishes. Or I've taken my mother for granted. She's just mum. That's what mums do. Mothers, like fathers, there is a Father's Day as well. They do the best they can with the knowledge they have for their children. There is no rule book. There are no, as such, guidelines. It comes from a natural instinct to mother and to father, to rear the young before they fledge the nest. And many people take mothers for granted. I'm guilty. We all are, to some extent. But they work extremely hard, and they do everything they can to the best of their knowledge and ability with what knowledge they have, quite often handed down from generation to generation. They are almost superhuman with the amount of work that they do in trying to give the best chance to their young. Exactly the same as animals. My Ava was rearing 11 pups on the street when she was rescued. How the hell she had the time to find her own food, to be able to feed the young, etc. And in what would have been hard times for her, but she fought to give her pups the best chance. And thankfully, I have one of them, don't I? Yeah. And they rescued her and all the pups were saved. She went to extreme lengths to protect her children, as parents do. So on a day like today, it's Mothering Sunday. I hope all of you can have a little bit of a reflection. I can't be with my mother on Mothering Sunday, or Mother's Day as it, here is, as it is here in the UK, to celebrate. But being off grid and the distance I travel and the frugal budget I'm on, it, I can't afford to, to go and see my mother as much as I would like to. That's where a little bit of modern technology comes into play because you can get cards sent and flowers sent online. And of course, I will ring my mother and have a conversation as we do every week or sometimes twice a week and catch up on my world, her world, and always have a laugh. Always make it a point to have a laugh. And I, for one, as much as there are points that I can see, oh no, reality says my mother is a true diamond because the good, the bad, and the indifferent. For one person in my life, that has always been there for me. Whether she's agreed or disagreed, she has always been there. That's my mum. So, mum, I know you watch this channel because you are aware of it and we do chat about it. From me to you, mum. Happy Mother's Day and to 
all of you out there. If you can't see your mother, phone your mother. Short bit of time will mean an awful lot to them. But I hope your day is a good day, Mum, and I hope you enjoy it. Anyway, from me and this one, I don't know where the big one is. Ava! I think she's just having a little bit of a wander. But from us, Mum, me and my girls, happy Mother's Day. Take care, everybody. Smile. Be happy. And above all today, be thankful for those that have looked after you when you've been unable to look after yourself. Take care, everybody. We'll see you soon. Remember the buttons. Ta-da for now.